booktube it's missy and today i'm finally doing a friday read i haven't done one of these i want to say since january it's been that long and so i'm going to share with you guys what i am currently reading and what i've been currently reading for the last two weeks i don't know what is taking me so long Ugh. but I can say I have been enjoying some of these books a lot. The first book I want to share with you guys is obviously Beautiful Creatures by Cami Garcia and Margaret Stoll. I am at 80%. I have this much left to read. Hopefully me and uh, Sylvia will be done by the 31st. I just... I don't understand why people hate this series so much. It is so good. Thank you so much, Penelope, for making me want to read this book. I just, I love it. I love it. There's so much tender moments in this, and I will obviously do a gush wrap-up when I am finished. We have a little less than maybe five days left before the book is done. Uh, I'm just, I'm just loving it. The next book I am currently reading, I'm still reading Don't You Forget About Me by Kate Carius Quinn. I have been stuck on page 202 for about four days now. I just haven't had the will to pick it up. Um, it is just beyond, I don't even know. I, I can't say it's boring because it's not really, I just, I don't know what the, problem is. I just don't feel a connection to the story at all. It's just completely, it's not, and again, it's kind of lame, but it's, I don't know. I'm indifferent to the entire book. I'm indifferent, and I think that's the problem. I don't have a strong emotion for either side, good or bad. It's just meh. And um, like you can see, I'm almost done. I, I just need to power through it so I can be done, and hopefully by the end of the month I will. The next book I am currently reading is, I don't want to show you the cover, only because it's, uh, I'm on, I'm 36% in and I don't know if I lose my page, but I am reading Compulsion by Martina Boone on my Kindle. It is a gothic, or southern gothic. Um, right now I am in the middle of finding out what the big reveal is in the story and why it is, um, fantastical. Um, it's set in, I, I want to say it's Florida or South Carolina. I could be completely wrong. Um, she's on an island, Watson Island, but I don't know where that is. And maybe I missed it. It was like the first chapter. Who knows? But so far it's okay. It's not the best story. And like I said, I'm only 36% in. Um, the sequel comes out this year, I believe, and so I do want to finish the book up so I can read the sequel, um, but yeah. And then the last one is Lock and Key, the fourth, I believe this, yeah, the fourth uh, book in the Lock and Key series by Joe Hill and Gabriel Rodriguez. I'm not enjoying this book as much as I enjoyed the other three, and I don't know what the problem is maybe it's just because I am in such a reading slump where everything's taking so long to read through but I just don't like the storyline in this one and I am halfway through this one as well so I mean it's a graphic novel I should have read this in one day I don't know why it's taking me so long to finish this book so those are the four that I am currently reading and I will hopefully um get done with at least one of them this weekend definitely all of them by the 31st and uh and that's it so i hope you guys have a wonderful weekend thanks for always coming and watching my videos i appreciate it i don't know if i should start signing off with the whole like comment subscribe because if you liked my video, you would like it, right? If you comment, obviously I could see it. And if you want to subscribe to my channel, then do so. I'm not going to force you to come and watch my extremely large book hauls or my wacky nature. But I do appreciate all of you who have come and stayed. So thanks again. I will talk to you guys soon. And peace out.